Randy the Rutabaker Goes to the Florida State Fair by Beepa Amet, illustrated by Beepa Amet. Randy the Rutabaker was getting pretty excited. He was on his way to Tampa, Florida and the Florida State Fair. Randy had never been to the State Fair, but he had heard about it. There were lots of rides and lots of good things to eat, so Randy started his adventure. The merry-go-round looks safe. Not too bad, although it was not too exciting. Maybe something a little more adventurous. Oh yeah. Now we're talking. Now this was more exciting. Randy was having a good time. Woohoo! Having fun now. Well, as what happens when you try a ride that was a little scary at first, but you found out you liked it, you try another scarier one. And that is what Randy did. Whoa! The swing didn't look too bad until it started going really fast. After Randy got off that crazy swing ride, Randy decided that what he needed now was something to eat. Well, Randy found lots of things to eat. Sausages and kebabs. A big plate of nachos. Randy even found cotton candy. Randy ate and ate and ate until he was full. Then he decided that what he needed to do was go on another thrill ride to settle all that food he ate. Not a good idea. First he went on the sky drop. The ride said drop, but Randy's stomach went up to his mouth. Then he went on the giant Ferris wheel, but somehow he fell out. Luckily, he got safely to the ground, but then it hit him. First, Randy started to feel real dizzy, and then, oh, Randy didn't feel good at all. Randy wanted to go home and go to bed, but the bus that took to the fair was not going back to his house for four more hours. Randy couldn't wait that long. What could he do? Then he remembered. Beepa. Beepa was giving helicopter rides at the fair. Randy went over to where Beepa was giving rides and begged him to fly him home so he could rest. Beepa felt bad for Randy, and since there was no one in line for a ride, Beepa told Randy to jump in. He would fly him back to his house. Randy was so glad to be back home. He sat in his easy chair and told himself that he would never eat so much and go on scary rides again. And so, Randy fell asleep in his chair to rest up for another adventure. The end.